In this video, we're going to be talking about what are the highest paid recruitment niches to get into. Let's get into the video. So the first thing I would say is you generally want to go for the white collar workers that have a high barrier to entry. Now, when I say that, I mean doctors, lawyers, architects, dentists, project managers, and there's one other area, which is executive search. Now, when I say executive search, I mean CFOs, CEOs, COOs, or any kind of chief executive level role. And the alternative to that would be construction directors or maybe managing directors of some type of organizations, even financial directors as well. Um, these are all great positions to earn extremely high fees. Now, there is a caveat to this because it does actually in turn um, matter what fees you're charging. And when I say that, I mean the percentage, the annual percentage of your salary that you're actually charging to these clients. So there's no point in recruiting for architects and dentists if you're going to charge a 10% or 5% fee, right? The idea of recruitment is the more skilled the position, the higher your fee should be. So that's how it works. The reason for this is because it's harder to find this talent. And so you should be rewarded accordingly for the work. So this is how it should work. For low level skilled workers, you can work on a 15% fee or 20% fee, for example. As you go through the ranks, let's say for mid-level worker, maybe a project manager, it should be at least 20, 22%. 25% is what we charged previously when I was working in an agency in Singapore. And then for director level hiring, anything really above 120K, you wanna be charging 30% fees for. So it does, it significantly matters. Let's say if you have somebody like a dentist on 130, 140K fee, uh, sorry, salary, and then you charge 30% of their salary, then naturally enough, the fee is gonna be extremely high. You can justify this because it's much harder to find this talent and you may not be making as many placements as you would be if you were hiring mid-level skilled workers, for example. So I hope this video was helpful. It's a relatively short one, but just to recap, in order to get the highest fees in recruitment and ultimately make less placements, but get more for doing less work, what you need to first do is increase your fees and, and increase your value um, or increase your perceived value that you have in your mind. That's the first thing. And the second thing is recruit for higher level positions, such as dentists, doctors, skilled white collar workers, or CXOs. Great, hope this video was helpful guys. If you want to start your own recruitment agency or learn how to grow your recruitment agency like I am currently doing, please check out my other videos where I explain step by step on how to do so. Uh, other than that, please like and subscribe to the content. It really helps me make other videos um, if you're enjoying it, of course. If you're not enjoying it, then don't subscribe. Take care, have a great weekend ahead. Cheers.